the vice president is as well. And sir, the second part of his question was about unidentified aerial phenomena. Do you want to talk to NASA's work identifying extraterrestrial life? You want me to talk about that? Or anyone, <laughs> Dr. Z. <laughs> well, I, I just want you to know, what you have seen on the uh, TV recently, on the Navy films, uh, I had known about this in my former capacity in Intel and the uh, Armed Services Committee. And I've talked to those pilots, and they think it's real. Uh, so I have talked to Thomas, Dr. Z, about what specifically we could do from a science perspective in addition to an intel perspective to try to bring any additional light to this. You want to comment on that? Yeah, look, I mean, I'm happy to. In the realm of science, we're all about unidentified unidentified issues and objects and whatever before. That's what we do. We find something with our obser observatories uh, looking at the sky, looking at mm -hmm. the earth, and we go analyze it. Uh, we have, uh, uh, you know, history is full of examples of things that were identified or were referred to as UFOs, you know, some types of clouds, uh, you know, phenomena, weather phenomena that way. And, uh, and for me, I, I personally think that uh, as we look at uh, uh, or the origin of life in other worlds, and then look at uh, at really what we what we especially at the molecular you know and, and, and bacterial level, which is uh, what we're really using the tools of science for. The kind of questions that focus on life elsewhere are are very much in the realm of what we do using the tools of science. So we will do whatever we can uh, to move our understanding forward. Uh, uh, in many cases, uh, all I wanted to say what we learned so far in the last few decades is people tend to underestimate nature. Uh, nature is an amazing place where a lot of miracles happen uh, that, uh, you know, once we understand, it's like, why didn't we think of that? But the point is, there is amazing uh, uh, science out there that remains to be discovered. We're committed to continue to do that, especially uh, as we t take uh, new tools, uh, whether it's James Webb, whether it's, uh, uh, you, know, um, you know, the Dragonfly, other missions uh, to look at uh, life in other, in other worlds. But if anyone knows how to do a spacecraft design like that, I would love to talk to them. <laughs>